We are here at Backbone Swag. Uh, we came in, I came in a couple days early in preparation for the uh, Long Beach trade show. And we've got owner operator Justin right here with us. And uh, he's gonna give you a walk through and a, a quick tour of his uh, fantastic print shop that he's got going on here. Glad you're here. Justin, all yours. Let's do it. Okay. Yeah, so this is our uh, 1,700 square foot I guess this is like an MTV Cribs. Yeah, it is. yeah I was saying, <laughs> tell us about um, it, okay? Yeah, so we started in our garage, uh, started advertising on Facebook, everything, like I told you, just kind of went exponentially higher. Uh, and we started to add more space as we added more team members and obviously more gear that you can hear in the background. Um, but everything you see here is all um, grassroots. So all of our gear that we print and ship out of here, just outside of Dallas, Texas, is, uh, okay. hey, that's what we do. Yeah, and I've you're got wearing it, got a shirt it right now. Yeah, I thought this is so cool. Yeah. <laughs> well done. All right, we'll follow you. All right, so uh, here is the, the the starting, and and we've been through many variations of this space because when we first started, we didn't have all this heavy equipment, so we we needed to adjust and accommodate, as you as you're going to be able to see. Okay. But we literally ship every package from right here, and. We write thank you notes on everything. Everything is a handwritten thank you note. We're very big on customer service. Yeah. Uh, we have racks of inventory. Uh, okay. We do a very unique style of printing. We do a modified like print on demand version. So uh, as things start to really grow and ramp up, we'll stock up. So when we stock up, we can ship quicker. Um, but whenever things need to transition or move, we can do that quicker as well. It's a lot of overhead but to cover. This is Cass. She okay. ships everything along with my wife over here. Um, this is a family um, operation that started in the garage and everybody is just like family. So um, we got an embroidery machine. So we do all our own in-house embroidery. Um, and this is something also too, YouTube University taught me. Okay. Um, and this is that modified version, printing on demand, right? So okay. if we have a shirt going, that's why we need the auto up. Okay, yeah. Having that auto up is, it means everything to us because we can print quicker, um, which means we can get orders out quicker. And that does two things. It, it shows the customer that we care about their order. We want to get that out. And it makes them understand how important they are to us and that, that they would want to come back. These are the first, so we have our monthly VIP program. So it's, um, people join, it's $24.95 a month. And we, we custom design a shirt every single month for our crew. Okay. Um, I did two things when we got this up and running. I did a limited edition run of our Bury the Excuses in gold on black with a back print. Um, that was really cool. And, but the very first thing I wanted to print on here was our monthlies for the, for the first month. And so um, that's honestly one of the coolest parts for me as a dad is my son was here um, helping me push the buttons. And, 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 and he hits the pedal whenever I'm like, all right, shirt's yeah, on, you're good yeah. to go. And so he loves doing that over here. And that's, that's probably like, I, I, I'm a big advocate as you can see here for keeping the screens. Uh, for us, I know that these are how we, you know, get the ink through and on the on the shirt. Um, but to me, it's a piece of history, and and I'm a very big advocate on history. I'm, I'm an advocate for for not losing um, sight of why you do something. And so, whenever I uh, sometimes the path to greatness is often walked alone. Um, that's why you got to stay true. Okay. So, What's a good win that Workhorse has done for you or why Workhorse or what have we been able to do to help you hit yeah. your goals here? I feel like I could rattle on forever about this, but for me, whenever I bought this machine, I bought it secondhand. Um, and the guy who had it, he's like, hey, everything still works. You're just gonna have to put it together. It was a, such a daunting task. And I remember getting it back here, finally getting it off the trailer, setting it here, and I'm like, put all the arms on, I'm like, now what? I'm ready to see this thing fire up. Um, apparently there's a circuit that needs a little plug on the flashback yep, yep, um, yep. that I learned. Yep. Uh, but the only way Everybody's I learned- Everybody's learned it with the flashbacks. But, okay. the oh, only, yeah, yeah. but the only way I learned that was the customer support that I got through Workhorse. 
when I called that number for the first time, which is what the guy bought it from, he was like, this is the best customer service you're ever gonna have. I was like, well, we'll see about that. And ever since day one, it has been nothing but that. Like ever, and, and I could not have put this together. Everybody has been happy to help. They've all asked us like, well, which one you got? And I tell them, they're like, oh, you got an old one. And they're, <laughs> it's just kind of like makes this like comical little bit. And I'm like, yeah, well, it's yeah. still a workhorse. We're still going. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah. But that was like, that was just something that I'll, um, I'll never forget putting this together. So I awesome. didn't feel like, it sounds cheesy. But like I didn't feel like I was alone. See, you know, your business growing and you know, going from this shop to your next one, is there like a like a culture thing that you guys work on or try to instill here as as your business is growing or, or going forward? Yeah. Well number one, we're glad you came, even though it's the craziest, busiest okay. day of the week. <laughs> um, but it works out. because uh, I think that everything happens for a reason. Um, and I and we're big believers in that. And this last week, and you know, two words that came to my mind that is very important for us to have here that I think is similar with Workhorse that I've been able to witness. And I just felt like God told me this weekend was just serve them, serve them. Um, you know, we ship out hundreds of orders a day. We get hundreds of orders a day. We put a lot of money on social media and we, we had to come to a realization that if we didn't serve them, them would be no longer. And we wouldn't have an opportunity to print shirts for people that change lives. Because we've literally had reviews where people talked about like how this helped them. You know, it's very hard to talk about, but to stop the suicide attempt or how it helped them in their marriage or how it helped them get through one of the hardest times that they, you know, the valleys. Yeah. And so, Mental, mental health. Yeah, yeah. mental okay. health side yeah. of things. Mental yeah. health is a huge part of our brand. Um, okay. But serving them is like, it's so prevalent for, for me right now. And I just feel like, like we had this conversation earlier. Like it's just, whatever I can do to serve them. Like, well, and we try to make our shirts, make them see that these aren't just shirts. Like there are people that are gonna wear these. So when you're printing a shirt, you're print, like you think of like the person you're printing the shirt for. Yeah. You know think about I mean? the, the lady who like, has two kids who. Yeah, they're yeah. humans that are gonna yeah. wear this, and this shirt means something to them. Yeah. So. She's like, uh, you know, <laughs> she's a big proponent in 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 making sure that I stay true to that. Like like we, there's many days I know other business owners, as males. Speaking from my point of view, there are days where I'm, I'm wondering how, like, how is this going to work out? And then she's just, she's always, the, she's the rock. She's, she's been there in some of the hardest times I've ever had in life and she's never left. And I mean, including this one, this is, this is one of the biggest ones. And as we transition to a new shop, yeah, well, there's going to be hurdles that we're going to have there. There's yeah. going to be, pain. Yeah, the, yeah, there's yeah. going to be we're opportunities where we're going to like literally call workhorse and ask like, you know, we, I, I've messed up, lost a bolt or something like that all, along the way. Cause it's just, it's, things are going to happen. But as long as we've been able to keep, and I think there for a long time, it's, it's just always been that we just didn't, we, we didn't identify that as like serve them. So as long it's easy as everybody to get lost in it, like yeah. as the shirts pile up, you just start seeing shirts and Not you know, people. It's like getting yeah. back yeah. to the root of it, which is people and serving people. It's yeah, it's okay. It feels such like you know my, what I was saying earlier about me getting out and then you guys saying that. It echoes a, that's I feel a lot of the same things because it feels good for me to be out and to see this yeah. right now we make a lot of machines every day every month they go all over the place and you know i'm in the grind of where's the next one where's the next one oh, and it's yeah. he, so nice to, he lives there okay <laughs> it's so nice to come and this is almost i mean it slows things down for me a little bit and it feels so good to know that we're making stuff that helps you guys yeah. make stuff that, that helps, helps other people. So it's crazy mm -hmm. like the domino effect so yeah That's